Hey there! If you're watching this video and you're sick, you've come to the right place. In today's video, I'll be sharing with you guys my 7 cold and flu hacks on how to make yourself feel better when you're sick. Not too long ago, I had the common cold that I also had, I think, a little bit of seasonal allergies and together it was like this super full-blown sickness. Never fun. I'm a super wimp when it comes to being sick. So comment below if you feel the same. So if you're watching this video and you're already sick, or maybe you think you might be coming down with something, here are my tips and tricks on how to survive those couple of days. Let's get started so you start feeling better. Let's go! The most important thing when you're sick is to make sure you're staying warm. Grab your favorite blanket or put on those layers to keep your body nice and toasty. Now some other ways to stay warm is using a magic bag. This thing has literally saved my life when I have the flu or the cold because sometimes you can get the chills and the magic bag is such an awesome little cuddle buddy because that's about the only thing that will get close to you when you're sick. I like to place it around my neck and also on the chest if I'm coughing up a lot. Now if you want to take it one step further, grab one of these electric blankets. Whenever I'm sick, I place this on the couch and just lay on top of it just to cozy up. The one great thing about this is you can adjust the temperature and turn it off whenever you're done with it. If you're congested, this is one of my favorite things to help with clearing out my nose. This is the Sage German Virus Fighting Remedy. I just use the roll-on ball and apply this to the palm of my hands. Rub them together and inhale the essential oils. And I always feel better and get a nice uplift in my energy whenever I'm sick. If you've got chest congestion or feel that tightness in your chest, using a soothing balm can also really help. This is the Sage Chest Cold Soothing Balm and it's pretty much like a vapor rub but natural and filled with rosemary and eucalyptus oils and it's great to help relieve upper respiratory tract symptoms and common colds. I just rub this on my chest and let it do its magic. Now if you're worried about your pillow being a breeding ground for germs, give it a wash and before bed, I love using this wellness mist on my pillow to help me get to sleep. It's a really great way to help relax and it's perfect before bedtime. If you've got allergies, Sinew Rinse is something I wish I had known years ago. It's amazing to help irrigate the nose and clean all that nasty stuff out. It comes with sodium bicarbonate packs and you just have to add filtered warm water into the bottle and irrigate the nose. Whenever I'm sick, I do a sinus rinse in the morning and at night right before bed and I really think it helps cut down the days I'm sick. You know when you're sick and it always seems like at nighttime is when it gets the worst? Try doing a eucalyptus steam. Grab a bowl, fill it with boiling water so there is steam, then add one to two drops of eucalyptus oil. Not too much because the vapors can get a little bit strong if you put more than that. Hover over the bowl and inhale the steam. I always do this when I'm sick and to make the steam last longer, put a towel over your head to keep the steam in. This is one of my favorite ways to help calm my congestion and coughing before bed. And last but not least, my go-to cold flu remedy drink. You'll need ginger, lemon, honey, and chili powder. First, grate the ginger. Ginger has natural antibacterial and antiviral properties that really help with cold and flu symptoms. Then add a slice of lemon, a tablespoon of honey, and then a dash of chili powder. Chili powder is a natural remedy for sore throats too. Now just add hot water, mix this all together with a spoon, and drink up. All right guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and got some tips and tricks on how to make yourself feel better when you're sick. Trust me, I know I hate being sick and I feel it. If you're watching this video and you're sick, I hope you feel better. I hope these tips help. So be sure to let me know if you liked this video and if you did, subscribe, give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and comment below and let me know if you have any awesome cold and flu hacks, tips and tricks you wanna share with me or with the community. I love you guys. I hope you feel much better if you are watching this and you're sick. Have a great week and I'll see you very soon in the next video. Bye.